Welcome back, guys. Today, I'll be talking about some of the blockchain and cryptocurrency stocks. The main stocks out that I'll be talking about is Riot Blockchain, FTFT, and Mara. So these three are the most popular cryptocurrency blockchain stocks out there. Uh, a lot of people have been talking about investing in those companies because uh, Bitcoin just hit $41,000, $42,000 today and is up around 51% on the week and up around 110 percent on the month which is kind of insane to think about so in terms of these cryptocurrencies specifically if you look at riot uh, blockchain it's up around 36 percent the week it's up around 200 percent on the month and if we can look at the yearly chart you know this is 1600 percent gains in the past year this used to be a penny stock you know, this was a 65 50 cent stock now it's all the way up to $25, $26. And if you look at uh, stocks which are similar, like Marathon Payton Group, uh, same exact thing. You know, it's up 2,280%. This used to be below, you know, 40 cents, 50 cent stock. And now it's uh, $27, $26. So all these, you know, cryptocurrency stocks and blockchain stocks are up, you know, well over 200, 2,000 to 2,000%. So I want to discuss why this is happening and how we can take advantage of this. Or if you want to, you know, join the Bitcoin hype or if you want to sell the Bitcoin hype, how we can do that. So let's get started. So the three main uh, blockchain and cryptocurrency stocks that I think uh, have the most impact bearing those fluctuations of Bitcoin are Riot Blockchain, BitDigital and Marathon Pin Group, like I discussed in the previous section. So personally, I think that cryptocurrency is a little bit overvalued in terms of, a, you know, a one to two month perspective. I think it'll go down But in terms of a future outlook. I'm not very sure, you know, Bitcoin can either go to a million or I think it can go back to uh, several hundred dollars. But we don't know yet. You know, um, things are you know looking very bright for Bitcoin, but we're not exactly sure. So. What is Riot Blockchain? Riot Blockchain is essentially uh, a company that finances new miner purchases through available working capital. So they buy, you know, mining sets, which they use in various factories. This is, you know, an appreciating asset when cryptocurrency goes up because the machines itself it increases in value. So all these machines always go above uh, retail value. I've seen it. I have one machine at home. Uh, I believe that machine was around 190 retail and I had to get it for 270. So that was kind of interesting. But whenever the cryptocurrency goes up, also something called hash rate, how much you can mine also goes down, right? So the difficulty to mine more Bitcoin is much harder. Uh, years ago, you could mine, you know, one Bitcoin in a day, but now you can only mine, you know, $10 worth in like two, three days. So that's... Uh, the difficulty rate is definitely going up there, but this is a good company because itself, it only focuses on uh, buying uh, mining sets, right? And then using it for themselves or selling it to other companies or licensing it out, which is pretty interesting. And it has no long-term debt. The financials are great. I believe this is the second biggest movement in terms of a cryptocurrency stock behind uh, Marathon Pain Group. So Bit Digital is a little bit different. Uh, it's basically... It has, it's a mining rig set up, right? They have 22,000 mining rigs all across the world and 16,000 required in the last third quarter. The hash power rate, I think, will basically go down in the near future due to the difficulty of mining uh, Bitcoin as it goes um, much higher in terms of price. I like how they're set up in China, which is kind of surprising for me. Like how I like Chinese uh, mining rigs is because the electricity costs are... Uh, four to five cents per kilowatt compared to the average 11 here in the US. So I think they, they are pretty profitable, but they have gained a substantial amount, 5,383%. I think I think they are projected to make money, but again, you have to understand that they've been doing this for so many years and they have Bitcoin from, you know, when it was like 3,000, 1,000, 100 bucks. So that's why they can expand now since they have that cryptocurrency on deck. Um, the price to sales ratio is not bad, but again, it's it's a mining company, and uh, I, I was I was interested. If I wanted to do specifically 
believe in Bitcoin, but they didn't want to buy Bitcoin. I think this is a stock to do it. You know, uh, they have a consistent mining rig. They have, I believe, the second most mining rigs in one operation in the world, which is kind of interesting. Uh, the next is Marathon Pain Group. I would say that, again, they also mentioned this is a pretty wild stock. It's really similar to Riot. I think it's gone up around 2,400% over the year. Uh, they are still losing money, but that was quarter three and cryptocurrency was, I believe, uh, 11K. Right now it's 41K, so that <laughs> that may be a big difference. The thing I like about all three stocks is that they have no debt. So it's it's only upwards if they can get the hash rate you know, to, to a better multiple. So this is basically what uh, Riot does, but I believe Riot's a bit more efficient than it is. Uh, the higher, yeah, like they said, higher pricing for Bitcoin is favorable because it leads to higher margins of returns. However, again, understand that hash rates become much difficult to mine. They are they aren't an you know investment company where they buy and hold. And Riot's been here with longer than that. You know they've been mining for a while now compared to a Marathon Pain Group. So now I want to discuss what our options are if you want to you know, take advantage of this craze. Uh, you think it's going to go down in the near term or you think it's going to go up in the near term. So as you can see, cryptocurrency, Bitcoin is up around uh, 9% on the day. It's around $41,300, which is kind of high. I think in my opinion, it's up around 40% on the week, up around 120 on the one month. And as you can see, it's been a really good year for Bitcoin. I remember during the March lows, it was around 3,500. So you have 11 extra money essentially if you bought during that dip. So I think overall Bitcoin, I'm not sure where it's going to land in the future. I don't like to speculate on, you know, uh, speculative assets like cryptocurrencies or uh, risky stocks like Riot. And the future can go either way. But, you know, just looking from, you know, this perspective, I understand it. it's not good to judge uh, stocks based on its stock price necessarily. I burn my hands, you know, at Tesla. This looking at the stock price, oh, it's too overvalued. But I'm looking at this, and uh, it seems like a very linear line to me. I think it will fall off a little bit, you know. As you see here, you know, good things always come to an end. But overall, you, you, you're not really sure what's going to happen. So I, I did take a position against cryptocurrency. It's not, you know, very, very big. But I did do it yesterday, so I'm, I'm a little bit down on it. I basically sold premium on Riot. I'm essentially saying by next week, it's not going to go above $31. Or otherwise, I would like lose my collateral. Um, I think this trade is very risky. It's one of my riskiest trades I've ever done. So just be very careful when you do this. It's basically selling a call and buying a call out on another um, further away uh, strike price. So that's called a credit spread. So we'll talk about that in another video. But if you want to do that, you, you know, you can short calls, buy puts, but uh, it's pretty expensive in terms of premium. In terms of shorting stocks, there's just no uh, stocks to short. I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, please leave a thumbs up. Between the three, I would say I like, in terms of long-term investment, is uh, Bit Digital. That's my personal opinion. It's gone up a lot since. But again, I still believe if cryptocurrency does go past 150000 the stock can easily exceed uh, 10x what it is right now. I hope you enjoy this video. Thank you for watching and have a good day.